Petrochemicals, an overview, a course prepared by Chemical Engineering Guy. Did you know that petrochemicals are everywhere in our daily life? In clothing, plastics, detergents, agrochemicals, and even in the food and health industry. But, how are they produced? What is all the science behind this? How can we produce the petrochemicals involved in our daily life? We will start the course by reviewing the petroleum refining industry, the raw materials involved and used as feedstock in the petrochemical industry, for instance, naphtha. We will learn about the steam cracking unit, which is the heart of the operations of any petrochemical plant. As the name implies, this process requires cracking of long hydrocarbon chains into more valuable products. We're going to get very technical on this. We're going to analyze several distillation columns and C2 and C3 splitters. We then continue with the treatment of the several cuts obtained from the naphtha cracking, typically C1, C2, C3, and so on, of which we get the following petrochemicals. Methane, hydrogen gas, phenol, methanol, ethylene dichloride, isopropanol, butadiene, humine, and many other petrochemicals. We're going to analyze several process conditions and its unit operations, for instance, reactions, temperatures, pressures involved, compositions, yields, and more importantly, final product specifications. At the end of the course, you will learn the main difference between the petrochemical industry and petroleum refining processes, the uses, applications, and importance of petrochemicals in daily life typical product demand and industrial applications, process conditions of unit operations, crackers, compressors, and so on. And, more importantly, several pathways for petrochemical production. Enroll now and bring your petrochemical knowledge to the next level.